all you need to do is step outside the studio and you'll find that the weather this Memorial Day weekend is one thing. Fantastic. And full of old vets. So in lieu of a weather report, we've invited fun in the sun expert, Tiffany Cartesian. <laughs> JR? JR, uh, Tiffany couldn't make it. She, she canceled last minute. So uh, they found me, Dennis Hurley. I was the only available person in the green room to, to do this. So, so I got her notes, though. So uh, I'll be the one giving you the, the, in the inside scoop on how to make the most of your time outdoors with my top five hot spots for the summer. Great. <laughs> <laughs> OK, number one, the Boston Duck Tours. Has everybody gone completely quackers? <laughs> If you're on the Boston Duck Tour, they probably have. <laughs> the tour, unlike any other, takes riders on a wild 80-minute land and sea excursion around Boston, where you learn about the rich history of the city. Um, I've seen those. There's no roofs on those uh, vehicles. So I would, I would personally, I would recommend a, a, a large white pantsuit <laughs> with, like, uh, long sleeves. But you can order it from the L.L. Bean catalog, J.R. You're not interested in catching some rays? Uh, not this year. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sorry, sorry. Uh, uh, moving on, uh, there's the Boston Sailing Center. It's a superb sailing school. The instructors are terrific, and there's also a great social atmosphere. <laughs> the club... <laughs> Uh, the club offers both uh, cruising memberships and racing memberships. <laughs> I would say, I would say, I would just recommend, I don't, I don't know if I'm allowed to, uh, uh, I, with the same attire, but remember to wear a, a, a hat that covers your whole face and the back of your neck. You know, like something that Rose Kennedy wore, but bigger. Because <laughs> that's what I wear. I'm just saying. Uh, third, we have the Hat Shell. Oh, yes, the Hat Shell is Boston's epicenter for large outdoor performances and open air events. Uh, there's classical, oldies, blues, jazz, rock and roll performances are held from spring through the fall amidst one of the most charming and historical uh, cities of our nation. Um, OK, this is a place I've been to. There is actually a shaded area far, far, <laughs> far away from the front of the stage. <laughs> where you could still enjoy the, the whatever's going on. I've been there a lot, and it's fantastic. Uh, but I would also recommend uh, uh, some polarized sunglasses uh, with UVA and UVB protection. Uh, if you're, speaking of, JR, do you have any sunglasses? I mean, this is br brighter than it's pretty, flames yeah. of hell. Yeah. We can't all <laughs> I feel nope. like I'm looking into my death. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> He doesn't have a lot of pigment, folks. Yeah, anyway, okay. Uh, who could forget Fenway Park? You haven't spent a summer in Boston until you've been to a Sox game. Cold beverages, fresh hot dogs. Um, okay, uh, if you're going to do this, put a sunblock on 30 minutes before you leave the house. Okay, so plan accordingly. And also, you should leave at 4 p.m. Don't leave any earlier than 4 p.m. So I hope that works out with the parking Hard for a Sox game. I've never been to one, so I don't, I don't know. Um, <laughs> Uh, make sure the sunblock is uh, SPF 70 or higher. It works. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, bring your whole family to Nantasket Beach or any of the other great beaches in the Pacific. Okay, I have, n I have never been to a beach. <laughs> uh, if we have a few seconds left, I'd like to uh, offer my alternative summer fun spot. Yeah. <laughs> Let her in. Uh, yeah, what will yours truly be doing this summer, 2009? Well, I'll be in the South Shore in my mom's basement, um, air-conditioned and windowless, watching the uh, second and third seasons of Battlestar Galactica. I just finished the, uh, the first season last night. Two words, fracking incredible. <laughs> and I have room for eight guests on my couch and two bean bags. I will be making uh, a batch of corn muffins. I've been told I make a mean batch of corn muffins. So, if you want to avoid a myriad of skin problems, uh, watch some sci-fi and save money in the process, email me at thesunissatan at gmail.com and uh, we'll watch movies until the wretched beast sleeps again. I mean, till 5 p.m. when 
the sun's rays become less ah, piercing. <laughs> Thank you, Dennis Hurley. <laughs>